Hey everybody, welcome back to Jimmy's Promo and Samsung just recently launched the latest updates for the Galaxy Z Flip 3, the Galaxy Z Fold 3, and the Galaxy S21 Ultra or the S21 series if you are part of the beta program. Now, I don't know for sure if everybody will see an update possibly either today or sometime this week, uh, but these official software version builds right here for the Flip and the Fold is BUL7 and that is for both of them. And really, this is just finishing out the whole beta program. Now let me know in the comments below if you guys got this update, if you got a separate update, if you got one even newer or maybe you got this one maybe a week ago, uh, but this one is just making sure that we are a part of Samsung One UI 4.0 because again these were part of the beta program. Same thing with the S21 Ultra over here. Now this version ends in B-U-K-K. Now, because these ones are rounding out, finishing off this whole beta program, the sizes are a little bit smaller uh, than what a big, big update would be, but they're a little bit larger than what a normal every month software patch would be. Normally every month, it's right around 200 and some megabytes. For the Galaxy S21 Ultra, this one's at 318 megabytes, 352 megabytes, and then 334. Now, what you would see, you know, if you were to take a look over inside of the Samsung members application, Again, we'll go inside of Samsung. Let's go inside of the Samsung members app. And then you might be able to see a little notification on the top. Then you'd be able to see the notices right here. So this is the information about the closing of the beta program, January 5th, which is right now of shooting the video. There, you know, there's no more releases for the beta software version. That's why it's moving us over into the official launch, the official build. Now, let me know if you guys are getting an update or maybe you already got the update. I know that it's been kind of a, a quite a while since these phones got any type of an update. So if I was to look over at the Z Flip, so the last time that I updated the Flip was November 28th, and that was pretty much the same as these ones over here. Now, if we go over inside of the settings over here, we'll take a look at the software update. Last updated was December 9th. So, you know, these ones over here definitely needed an update for sure. The Galaxy S21 has one a little bit recent of December 9th, uh, but these latest updates that I'm seeing here that we're able to download, these ones are giving us the December patch. So I'm a little curious if there will be a another small update right after this, which will give us the January patch. But I wanted to let you guys know if you're part of the beta program, take a look, see if there's an update waiting for you. If you're not a part of the beta program, also take a look to see if there's an update for you. You might be able to get the full fledged One UI 4 you know, program or the four uh, software launch on your phone because this one's has already have it for, you know, already had it for quite a while. But now that it's done, it's rounding it out, giving us the official software version build. So what I'll do is I'm gonna have all of these download. I'm gonna have them all get installed right now. Uh, I'm not gonna look at all three of the phones to take a look at different applications to see if there's different versions of different apps. The only phone that I'll do that with is gonna be the Galaxy S21 Ultra, just because I feel more people have the Galaxy S21 series than any of these flips and folds. So all we're gonna do is we're gonna take a look at the Samsung Home, the Samsung Camera, Messages, Internet, also the Fingerprint Reader and Face Recognition. That's the only ones I'm gonna take a look at to see if there's newer versions on this phone. Because more than likely, if there's a newer version on the Galaxy S21 Ultra, there's also newer versions over here on the Flip and the Fold. Now it's usually at this point in the video, I like to state that if you guys are brand new here at the channel, Jimmy is promo. You appreciate these tips, tricks, tutorials, and the latest information on your Samsung Galaxy devices. Make sure you guys hit on that subscribe button as well as the bell for notifications so you get notified for all future videos. Oh, and welcome to the first Samsung video of 2022. Welcome to the new year, everybody. Hopefully this year brings blessings and hopefully a little bit better year in 2022 than what everybody has had in 2021. So all of the love from Jimmy is promo over to you guys. So the update is done and complete on all three devices. And what we will be doing now is taking a look over at the Galaxy S21 Ultra, because I do wanna take a look at some specific applications, see if there's any newer versions and more than likely if there's a newer version here, then it also means that there's newer versions, uh, you know, either in, inside the biometrics and security and some of these applications. So if we see that here, it'll be in the other devices as well. So first off, when it comes over into Samsung Home, the original version that we had before this update was 13.001.12. This one's 13.001.12, so it's the same version there. Now we're gonna take a look over inside of camera, and so we'll take a look uh, on the very bottom. Originally it was 12.00.083, and this one is 12.00.083, so that one is the same there. 
we'll head inside of Samsung Messages. Samsung Messages for this version here originally was 13000113. This one's 13000113. Then we're gonna take a look over inside of the internet. So it looks like a lot of these are pretty much the same versions, uh, but originally when you do this big massive update, you will see a bunch of changes. So originally for the internet, it was 160623. 160623. And then we'll take a look over inside of the biometrics and security for the fingerprint reader face recognition. So far, we haven't found anything that was brand new with this update. Again, it was a smaller one on the smaller side, or a little over 300. Uh, so for the fingerprint, it was 6000. Same thing here. And then same thing for the face 2113. This one's also sitting at 2113. So there's no newer versions of some of these applications we just got done taking a look at, but we now are on the final release build in terms of the public release of Samsung One UI 4.0 and all three of these devices. Again, last update here was January 5th. You can see that we have it. I will just search for one more software update just in case if there's another one because we're still sitting on that December 1st patch. So more than likely with all of everybody within Samsung offices going back to work, it's after you know the new year, more than likely they will be working on this. So we will probably see this maybe middle of January giving us the January 1st patch. So that is it for today's video. If you guys appreciated this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to hit on subscribe. Subscribe on the very bottom left-hand side right over here. And if you appreciate this video, then you'll also like this video on the other side. And I'll see you guys later.